Hello Internet, look what I have acquired! Here I have a wonderful red mobility scooter. Now of course, I've got history with these machines. I was the first person to set a land speed record on one. I've got a green one which will do 82 miles an hour. But that was eight years ago. So this time, I want to return to these wonderful machines. And I want to do something a little bit different. I just want to just keep adding stuff to it. I'm going to let my creativity go wild. It may get a bit weird. Let's get on with it. You know, you get a car, you want to pimp it up. Normally, first thing you do, slap some wheels on it. Very nice, Colin. The rear one's actually quite easy. Just got a little bit of spare axle left over from the 100 mile an hour dodging project. <laughs> You don't even need a lathe. You can just drill it out of a 19 mil drill, put the grub screws on, whack it on. Bosh. Now then. You may have noticed I have created a small problem for myself. We've got no steering. So what we're going to do, we're going to lift the body up, which is going to be good because some of the future modifications, that's going to give me a little bit more room underneath it. Ooh. Electric stuff's quite easy to work on because you've literally just got a battery and a motor. And if we want to jack it up, just make some spaces drop the whole thing down, lift it all up, don't have to worry about chain tensioning or anything like that, it's brilliant really. And as far as other things, I can get rid of a few of these boxes, because that's a charger, don't really, well I don't need it in here, I'd like to keep it in here because it's quite useful, but it can go anywhere in the whole scooter. And then this thing here, the speed controller, we can just lay that flat somewhere, so that will get, generate a bit more space under here, and then the front, I think we'll just drop it down in a similar manner, I don't know, I've not even looked at it yet. job of that. In fact, the more I look at this thing, the more I think it should have an engine in it. However, been there, done that, we're doing something different. Now then, we've done the wheels, we've lifted it up. Next on the list, I think we need to improve the sound system. But improve it? There isn't one! That's the problem! Like a moped, I'm going to make like some steel plate fairings, which are going to come down here. Inside them, 
I'm going to put the speakers, we'll have four speakers, two each side, and I've got this stereo, I've robbed this out the spa car, actually. <laughs> That's going to sit up underneath there, and it's quite good because this is not a CD or a tape deck, it's an MP3 one, so it's not very deep, there's not a lot to it. That sits under there nicely. Now my plan is, if I can make a template using a bit of cardboard and then kind of draw it in the computer, we can cut this out on the plasma cutter in one whole bit that folds down, nips all this up, very nice. It might not work, I'm making it up as I go along, because you may have worked out from these Colin Furs videos, I don't really do much planning, I just make it all up as I go along. And this is no different. Stage one complete. Now then, the next thing that I'm going to do is slightly more complex. I'm hoping it will be next week's video. If it is the week after that, I do apologise. I'm only one person. But there we are. Subscribe, turn on the notifications, all that social media jazz and everything, and I'll see you there. Woo!